Hello everyone and welcome back to the match here on WWE 2K22. This one is going to be Mark versus Jay Briscoe in an Extreme Rules match. The brothers are going to go at it one-on-one. -on -one. And this should be a fun one, this. I mean, just a little bit of fun. Of course, the pair of them will be fighting for the SWE Tag Team Championships tomorrow. As well as Jay Briscoe also fighting for the United States Championship on Sunday as well. So lots of action still to come for these two. And this is just a chance for one of them to build some momentum. Uh, I just realised I've not marked this down on the old spready sheety. There you go, all that can go. And we're there, okay. Okay, right. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Uh, did I hit subscribers yet? Oh, I need three more subscribers to hit 6,500. We are getting closer. If you're not subscribed, make sure you do. Help me out, you know. Help me dislike us back on the old videos. That's good. All right, Jay Briscoe now locking in with the Cloverleaf. The annoying thing with this game is that even though there's extreme rules, they don't always use weapons. Which is a little bit annoying. You know, have some fun. Grab yourself a, grab yourself a weapon. Mark Briscoe now then launching his brother over to the outside and Jay is going to come straight back in. Neither of the two going for weapons as of yet. I mean, of course, the pair of them, they want to win this match. They want that extra bit of momentum moving forward. Of course, it's probably more important for Jay because then he does have the singles championship match coming up on Sunday. But at the same time, they're brothers. They don't want to severely injure each other, which might be why they hold back on the weapons somewhat. Neckbreaker there by Mark Briscoe. Going to bring Jay back up into that fisherman's brain buster. Mark now up on top. Nope, decides against it. I think he might be thinking about that 450 elbow, but decides against it. Going to go for that arm breaker instead. Big boot into the spine there by Jay Briscoe as well. As he does head to the outside, is he thinking about some hardware? He is indeed. He's under the ring. But Mark is there. Baseball bat drops to the ground. Not used. Mark Briscoe was not having any of that, was he? Then again, now Jay fighting back. Clubbing blow against the back. Jay once again looking for some fun. He's found a kendo stick. But again, Mark is having none of it. Just hits Jay with a suplex now looking for the arm. And once again looking to stamp on the back of the arm doing damage. Mark swung the baseball bat twice and both times missing Jay. As Jay now in with that short arm lariat flips. Mark Briscoe over. Neither of the two have been able to use the weapon as of yet. And there goes Mark straight into the ring steps. And now the baseball bat across the spine of Mark Briscoe by his brother Jay. Brutality. Mark is back up. Pings the baseball bat out of a hand. And then throws Jay Briscoe to the other side of the ring away from those weapons. Mark now sending Jay straight into the ring steps once again. Mark Briscoe now has the kendo stick right to the spine of Jay Briscoe. And then he dropped his hit. He dropped his hit. He dropped it. Mark Briscoe now brings Jay back up to a standing base once again. And throws him across the outside via the neck. Brutality. Mark re-enters the ring and, uh, you know, just trying to get the fans behind him. I mean, the fans are behind both of these. They love the idea of these two going to war. They know how much the brothers uh, enjoy going to war as well. Jay going to re-enter the ring, but he's bringing his baseball bat with him. And Mark was ready, though. Jay ducks underneath the clothesline, catches Mark straight up into the Jay Driller. Middle of the ring, out of nowhere, Jay Briscoe hits the Jay Driller. For the one, the two, and the no. 
Not quite enough for the free count. Mark Briscoe now. In with a Death Valley driver. He's going to go for the win now. There's the one. The two. Oh, and Jay kicks out now as well. The pair of them showcasing what they can do. And Mark now up on top. Is he going to hit that four fifth? No, he's going for the shooting star. Big shooting star press. Oh, now. Mark up top once again this time. Is he going to go for the... 450 elbow drop. Mark Briscoe, surely that's enough. The Death Valley driver, the shooting star, and the 450 elbow was not enough to keep Jay Briscoe down. Mark can't believe it. He cannot believe it at all. There's the cutter over the top. Jay kicking Mark away. Mark Briscoe fighting back with a strike in the gut, looking for the one on the side of the head, but Jay fought back. Strong strikes here by Jay Briscoe. And now Jay dropping Mark to the outside. It's been a great match here so far. And looks like we're going to see some more action here from Jay Briscoe. He's thinking about going for the dive. What do we think of these cores, by the way? I'm not 100% sure on them. But I think they are the best ones available. I'm just not 100% sure on them, to be honest. Again, I'm not very good at judging, to be honest. I am i don't know if I might have some sort of like minor... I wouldn't say minor disability, probably the wrong phrase, isn't it, really? But I do struggle. I don't, I'm generally quite good at recognising faces, but when it comes to comparing two faces, I can't quite tell you what the similarities are, if that makes any sense. Oh, my God. Wow, Jay Briscoe just took a baseball bat right to the skull and then pinged off the 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 barrier. Then several more strikes of the baseball bat as well here by Mark. And Mark needs to think about how much he needs his brother for the tag team championship match coming up tomorrow rather than just absolutely destroying the midriff with that baseball bat. Um, Mark? Mark. Mark, you need to stop, Mark. Mark, it's time to stop. Um, hmm. Jay finally does roll out the way after receiving about 20 baseball strikes to the gut. Which is not a, uh, a, a enjoyable time. Benny Stretch of the Imagination is a short clothesline. Absolutely ripples Mark Briscoe. Mark now sending Jay straight back into the ring steps. Mark once again bringing Jay back up to a standing base. Then in with that half and half suplex on the outside. There's the sledgehammer now right into the gut. Jay now re-entering the ring. Of course, this is no disqualifications, but, um, ow. No disqualifications, no count outs, but, um, sorry, the cat bit me. Um, but, um, pinfalls and submissions have to take place inside the ring. What is that? Oh, I know what that is. I've just had a notification from PayPal telling me I've just paid £105 to Steam. That is for 2K23. Jay Briscoe up on top, dives in with a big clothesline, flattens Mark. I thought he might go Jay Driller again, but no, going to dump Mark into the corner. Mark fighting back. There's a boot in the gut by Jay. Now Mark catches Jay up on the shoulders, in with a Death Valley driver, rolls it through into the pin. And there's the win, Mark Briscoe, big victory over his brother Jay. I mean, Jay needed this one. He is going on for a United States Championship match in a few days' time. But what a match between the two brothers. What a match indeed. All right, let's give out the old ranking point. So Mark Briscoe gets a singles win. No, oh, I've got to sign into the spreadsheet first. 
There we go. Oh no, I've lost it now. There we go. Brisco. Brisco. Right. Matt Brisco gets the singles victory, moves him up to a plus three. Jay Brisco gets the singles loss, moves him down to a minus. Sorry. Blah, blah, blah. Mark Briscoe gets a singles victory, moves him up to a minus three. Jay Briscoe gets a singles loss, moves him down to a minus four. So not great at all. But they've got an opportunity, like I said, the next two days is the big chance for the Briscoe brothers. Of course, the tag team championship match tomorrow evening against AJ Styles, Amazing Red. The Dudley Boys and the current champion, the Steiner brothers, in that fatal four-way elimination tag team championship match. And then, of course, on Sunday, Jay Briscoe versus Lex Luger for the North American Championship. But squeezed in, we'll have a couple of other interesting sort of Ring of Honor matches tomorrow. Samoa Joa versus CM Punk in a Bloodsport match uh, inside that.